In a series connection, all the components are connected in the single path. Here we will see the series connection visually. And for that, we are going to uh, construct the circuit along with the two bulbs in series. And ground them. And here's how the current flows across the circuit. Uh, it's AC current, so it uh, alternates along with the time. You can see here the fluctuations. And here we have this physical circuit. Now we will measure the voltage across them. It's about 245 volts. Current always tries to flow through the lower resistance. Hence when we touch the closed circuit's naked wire, we don't get shock. Because our body has more resistance than the bulb. In series connection, the intensity of emitted light is low uh, because the voltage is divided between them. And here is the calculation of current across the equivalent resistor. It's about 1.15 ampere. And now the parallel connection. In parallel connection, the components are arranged along the multiple paths. So the applied voltage across each component is same. Uh, here we have these two bulbs arranged in parallel. Let's see how they work. Uh, yeah, you can see here the fluctuations uh, the same as in series but the intensity of light is more. I have fixed this uh, 1 kilohertz that is 1000 times alternations in just a second. And here it glows with more intensity. That's why the household connections are in parallel. Now we will measure the voltage across them. It's about 240 volts. It is the reading of applied voltage. And here also we don't get shock. For the same reason. The current across the equivalent resistor is 4.6 ampere. That is more than the series connection. That's why it glows brighter. Do subscribe for more scientific videos.